Oh mate, how's that again? You doing good still? <laughs> hey, what's up guys? <laughs> Seventies, welcome back to one of our Blade and Sorcery mods video, dog. As you can see, we got this epic mod installed. It's called Magical Lashings, and you can destroy people with it. As you can see right here, I'm uh, using it to my advantage to create my perfect world, basically. Oh, what's that? That's just that's another project I'm going. I've got going on at the moment. Sorry about that. Anyway, guys, if you're new to the channel, uh, make sure to subscribe, check that bell, and oh, sorry about that. Remember, guys, like the video if you uh, you love. Lashing torture. All right. Let's get straight into this. Let's go. <laughs> okay, so there's quite a few things that you can do with these uh, these magical lashings. Look at this. I can't go over this. This is beautiful. Absolutely wonderful. I love this, guys. Oh, here comes our next victim. Her name's Stacy. She comes from the block. Hello, Stacy. Ow. As Stacy's uh, shown you right there, you can actually not only get my way, Stacy. You can actually walk into these things and interact with them. Look at that. I can just climb up my, my other project. Look at this, to see how he is. Maybe he's a bit hurt, who knows? Hello, hello former project. How are you? He sa he's saying no, no, he's saying yes. He loves this, guys, he loves this. Not only can you, uh, you can interact with these things, you can also decapitate people with them, and you can also treat them like zip lines. Whee! Yeah! Come straight down onto you. What should we do with you? Who knows? Boop on the nose. So let's get this out here. Let's, um, what would happen if we attached her face to this? Oh my god! As you can see, very good decapitation device. Let's just get rid of the evidence for this before the police turn up. I didn't think your head would actually just rip off like that. I call this pot head. <laughs> Ow! What oh shit, bruv? You wanna end up like this guy? Hang on a minute, look, look what's happened to this guy. Look at this. His leg's been pulled off. Sorry about that, bruv. Now, apparently you can snip them, but I'm not sure how to, how to snip them off. Right, uh, hang on. Ow! Let me just attach your, your ankle here to, uh, oh, to this box. Off he goes. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. His leg. Hello, Ginger Beard. Come with me. I'm going to make a nice, beautiful little hanging display for you guys. Put this guy right up here. Look at that. He just gets pulled up by his chow. <laughs> can, we, can we not get them to decapitate, please? Is that a thing that we can do? Come here, wench. As you can see, there's a head hanging up there, but we're going to try and keep you in one piece. Oh, knocks herself out on the wall. Okay, so if it's in slow-mo, we can actually prevent her head from popping off like a bottle of pop. And she's just bouncing up and down there. Look at this. It's like a, a little game, a little ball game maybe you'd play outside. As you can see, she's screaming. It's beautiful noise, beautiful ambience to the ears. Okay, we'll keep you there, darling. Can we get another one, please? <laughs> <laughs> this looks beautiful. It's coming along nicely. Ah, Geralt of Rivia, welcome. This is my art display. I call this one, uh, Bouncy Bodies. Some of my finest work. Do you want to be a part of it? I'll stop it. Let me just take this and, uh, oh no, put it on this guy's leg. Oh god, ha <laughs> ha. Yes. Now what's happened, Geralt of Rivia? You're going to get up and then realize that you have no blade. What's this? Uh, I, I don't want you to have that, mate, alright? Pull over there. I don't want that. You're not having that. You're fighting me mano el mano. What's this? I've just attached you to the wall, bruv. Oh, I just attached him to the other side. Look at this. It's going to be a perfect torture device. <laughs> what are you like that? Perfect. Then we're going to use you as a trampoline, bruv. <laughs> Wee! Bouncy, bouncy, Geralt. Bouncy, bouncy. What happens if I attach you up here? Whoa! <laughs> that's like the most that's the most awesome ride I've ever seen in my life. Comment down below if you'd like to try this ride out. I want this to be a real ride. Come here, bruv. <laughs> I'm just gonna get these two maces here and I'm gonna sort out what we're gonna do with you, bruv. I'm gonna put the two maces right down here like this. I'm gonna attach the grapples to him and uh it's not gonna be good for you, mate. Just let's just say that. Oh, whoa, 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 look how far his head went. His head just flew over the mountain. Oh, I've just got a really odd, good idea for a catapult. Hey, stay there, bruv. Keep an eye on your girlfriend. Her head's about to snap by the looks of it. Okay, let's just get this like this and put that there and that there. Perfect. Right, go over there, bruv. Go. Stand still. I'm just going to pick you up. Get over there. Get over. He's crossed the finish line, everyone. Okay, guys, I call this one hammer time. <laughs> Hello. Oh, I broke his legs. Pull it back as far as we can. And... Oh, 
wanted you to trip up. You ruined it. Get off. I have to kill people that don't comply with my demands, guys. G give me time to pull it back, bruv. Stay back. <laughs> Get off. Get off hammer time. <laughs> As you can see, hammer time is very good at destroying people's rib cages. Get out of here. Perfect way, <laughs> perfect way to get rid of your dead bodies, guys. You just like, just attach them to the walls. Hi, right, hello, guys. Here we are at the early learning center with Frank. Frank here is going to show us what happens when uh, we put a sword pointing outwards. Not early learner. What am I on about? Sorry about that. Health and safety. Not early learner. Health and safety uh, here. We're going to show you what happens when you accidentally leave a sword sticking out of a, a wooden pole here and then someone decides to use elastic grappling things to pull you into the sword. It's not good. It shouldn't be practiced in any workplace. Uh, let's see how it goes. Okay, we're just going to attach you to this, Frank, and see how it goes from there. All right, mate? It's going to attach this, like this. And then we're going to pull it round, and we're going to attach it to your face. Just like that. Oh, it just pulls his head completely off. Hang on a minute. Frank, we have to redo that, bruv. Well, the camera wasn't rolling. Whoa, look. This looks like the scene where Kylo Ren stops that bolt. Oh, there's his head. Look, attached to the other side of it. Frank, we're going to have to do that again, buddy. <laughs> Hello. Nice haircut, emo. You look like emo Spider-Man. <laughs> we're going to have to attach you a bit higher because gravity, you know. Look, look at us. Don't spit on me. I heard that. Go. Whee! Oh, very close to the spike, but not quite. Come on, guys. Someone here's got to die. It's got to happen. Oh, this guy looks aggressive. He looks like he's the type of man that can withstand the sword. Whee! Oh. Hello there, mate. Do you want to get out of the way? He's, he's next in line for the ride. Sorry. Oh. oh, get stabbed in the rear, bruv. Oh, straight in his rear. Move out the way, okay? We've got more people to go. Whee! Oh, this feels dangerous to this guy's health. <laughs> I kill. I call this the Pillar of Doom. That's right, Frank. Stay there, bro. <laughs> Hello, guys. Welcome back. I just had an idea. What would happen if we put these crazy elastic things on arrows? Uh, Frank here has been very kind just to give us a demonstration. <laughs> Tie it to Frank. Tie it to the arrow. Just like that. And then we just let the... Do you mind? Let the arrow go. Oh, dude, that's awesome. Look at that. Come here. Come here. You want to go too? Oh, God, that's very biblical. <laughs> you want to go too, yeah? All right, come on. Come on. Come on. You're going up too, bruv. Go up next to Frank. Hey, right, come on now. Take it easy. Don't get all dirty on him. Oh, they go so quick. Oh, that's awesome. I love that. Let's just break his leg off now. I don't know why he's got legs, to be quite fair, guys. Break his leg off there. Oh, God, it hasn't broke. His leg didn't break. Perfect. Now he's in a world of hurt because we're going to put an arrow underneath him and attach it to his booty cheek. Oh, God, they go so quick. Look how biblical Frank looks. Now we're going to grab this guy's face and put it into his... his... Hey, what the... What's happening? I'm sorry, you're going to have to get arrowed, bruv. I just attached to him. Hey, I want your face in his... Uh... How hard is that? Is that hard? I think that, that's hard. Oh, oh, God. I call this one a head. Oh, shit face. I haven't decided. Okay, Billy. It's been a while. I know you've shaved your head and you think you're a bad boy now, but look at me. Look at me. Look at me. I still love you. But if I can't have you, no one can. I'm sorry. Goodbye, sweet prince. <laughs> what are you looking at? Get over there. Oh, your sword just flew away. Where are you going? Where are you going? You're not picking that one up. You're coming with me. Can I attach it to myself? <laughs> Get rid of that sword. You don't need that sword, bruv. You don't need that sword. Push him down the cliff. <laughs> Push him down the stairs, just like I did to my auntie. Ah, uh, look. He's got a stiffy. <laughs> Stiffy boy. Wait a minute. Can I climb all the way up this? I'm going for a climb, Ma. I'm not sure when I'll be home. Bye-bye. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. It, it, don't cry, though. It'll be all right. Oh, hello, Hammer Time. Nice to see you again. <laughs> anyway, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. You want some more Blade and Sorcery? Let me know in the comments below. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. Wee! Ah! What the f***? My arm! Ah! <laughs> what the hell is this?
What happened to me? I've just transcended to a new dimension, Ma. I'll be late for dinner. Thank you everyone for becoming members on the channel. Today's pirate shoutouts are Antonia Raphael. Oi. Stephen Dogger, Jacob Brotherton, Zach Martinez, Stephine Clark, Wesley Gibbons, Timio, and Selectra. You want to click that little join button right below if you want to become a member of the channel, get a shout out and other rewards such as sexy little badges next to your name in the comments. And if you go for the top tier, I would personally roast your friends on a video. Thanks, guys. Bye.